Well, Towson University's men's basketball team will work to get your attention this weekend, and their battle against James Madison is only part of what they want you to see. As 11 News' Jason Newton explains, there's another piece of the puzzle coaches will be wearing, and you could help with their cause. Towson coach Pat Scary remembers back to what was a mysterious diagnosis at the time. We had another son, and he just wasn't hitting the same benchmark. His young son, Owen, would have autism, and Scary and his wife pressed for a quick study and early intervention for Owen. He was at Kennedy Krieger the last couple of years, and Trellis, now he's full day in Baltimore Public Schools. He's got an aide, but he's full day kindergarten. Um, yeah, it's been off the charts good. And for the past three years, he and Georgia Tech coach Tom Herrian, whose son is also autistic, have worked to help other families find a similar path, and they pounded the hardwood to get other coaches to join their fight. We said, hey, how many TV games are there in February, college basketball? There were 41. And that's why we said, let's hit those guys and get them all the way to pin, and that's where it took off. Now, coaches with some very visible programs have joined this fight, donning the autism puzzle piece pin, making live television audiences of thousands more aware of their cause. One in 68 kids today, it's the, it's the largest growing developmental disorder in the country, and there's no cure, so it's going to keep you know, rising. Based with that reality, the Scary family is thankful for their basketball family putting the attention on kids like Owen and the challenges ahead. In Towson, Jason Newton, WBAL TV 11 News.